Light! Enough news of your good works has been passed around that people like you. That's nice. Where's... Bad guys dealt with. Okay. Big Sal is dead. Kachino is dead. Nero is dead. Everyone's dead. Everybody. Everybody's dead, Dave. And I still have no idea what is going on. Yippee, yeah. There'll be no wedding bells for... And we're back. And still clueless. That's right. I have no idea what is going on. Well, I... I know everybody's dead. I've shot everyone. That's not true. I shot... Nero. Big Sal shot Kachino. Kachino shot Big Sal. Assuming you guys didn't get involved, and I don't think you did. So these guys shot each other, and I shot Nero. And Nero and Big Sal wanted to shoot me and Kachino because we were messing with their plans. We wanted to shoot them because they were shooting us for messing with their plans. <clears throat> but the big unknown in this is uh, what their plans were. Th they had a guy shipping in weapons. That sounds like a big part of some major plan. They had another guy filming snuff movies, which is twisted, but I'm having a hard time coming up with this super uber plan that the NCR were worried about. Or maybe they just, maybe they just knew that there was some snuff movie distribution and wanted it ended. I mean, that is possible. I mean, that would be laudable as well. And I'm not totally sure that's how the NCR work. I think they were thinking these guys were a threat to them, not actually, you know, a threat to peace, justice, and sweetness and light. And that is... Oh, I was going to drink, wasn't it? That is going to annoy the hell out of me. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm glad they're dead. Very glad they're dead. I am... I'm perfectly happy to kill people who get up to the sort of things they're getting up to. And I'm not even that sad to see Kachino go. Because apparently he wasn't a very pleasant person either. And let's face it. There were several times I came close to shooting him. However... I just hate... Well, I want to say unfinished business, um, all loose ends, because we've pretty much snipped all the loose ends. I hate not knowing. Okay, there you go. I'm glad they don't let just any motherfucker through the gate. Free side smells like shit. Well, it smells even worse upstairs because there's dead bodies. That follower fucker is going to have some trouble if he tries to liberate any of our employees. Okay, he doesn't want to talk to me. I'm, I'm just... I'm wondering if... There's a manager I've missed. Somebody who's now Business in. This is good. All the family's got money. Of course, Gamora's where the action is. Nevada slip. Gamora is always open for business. King sold out to the NCR. Okay, you don't want to talk to me. How about you, Nevada Slim? Nevada Slim, talk to me. Dude, talk to me. Talk to me. Fine. You guys are under new management. I've no idea who that new management is, and I don't care. Hello, and welcome to Gamora. What can I help you with today? I don't suppose you... No, you didn't. Bye. I just wondered, maybe she was going to say, Oh, now everyone's dead. I'd like to tell you their horrible plan for the wasteland. It was terrible. It's morning. All right, no, let's get back to the NCR and give them the good news that we stopped something. I can't believe I'm not allowed to park my van at the dam. Okay, I'm still having that problem. I need to get my eyes checked. When I first step out of the van, I often have difficulty focusing on roads. Yeah, I... They won't let me park. 
Mind you, maybe it's more a, a matter of... Nobody's fixed the bloody road. I could drive down here. I'm pretty sure I've driven over rougher ter terrain than this. I mean, granted, the bridge itself is uh, pretty much impassable, I suppose. It's not that far. I get I'm getting old and lazy, aren't I? Yeah, so... The thing with the... Omertas... I've left a power vacuum. Now, I know this is helping NCR out, and hopefully NCR are going to help me weather the anger of Mr. House. But I can't help but feel removing the Omertas... The Omertas from the equation hasn't actually achieved anything useful for me. No, I can't see it, really. And it, of course, has left the question that keeps burning in my mind. I... Okay, I think that was a ranger. Sneaky devils, which I guess is the entire point, I suppose. Right, let's go and talk to... Was it a colonel? It was probably a colonel. Person in a uniform. The music's a little... Well... Okay, am I going in the right direction? Patrol in the Mojave oh. almost makes you wish for a nuclear weapon. Box! Bobblehead energy weapons! Do not add a bonus. Increase energy weapons by two. Increase energy weapons by five. Increase any... No. No. What's that? Oh, I remember. I remember. Right. Quartermaster Barden. Hi. How you doing? I was talking to you. Don't... Oh, I was trying to talk to you. Always nice to have a friend of the NCR around. What can I help you with? I don't suppose you know what the Omertas were uh, up to. No, probably not. I'd like to purchase something. I... Tell me about yourself. I guess I can spare a minute or two for you. Things are a little slow at the moment anyway. Oh, God. I should have some stuff to sell you. I've been in the military my entire life. It's a family sort of thing. My father served, my brothers serve, and I serve. I've had the honor of serving all over the NCR, and now I get to be out on the front lines as the NCR comes out east to help these folks here. Once we get rid of the Legion, this will be a better place for everyone. I'm proud to be part of that. I mean, he sounds like he believes it, doesn't he? I mean... Bye. You know, he thinks he's helping people out, which I suppose you could argue... That if the choice came down to them, or... I mean, I am lost. Them or the Legion, like it, it's pretty much Still a no-brainer. I really don't remember this place. I think I've gone the wrong way at some point. Power plant? For the kings to back down. They didn't know who they were with. Okay. Shh. Okay, I'm, I am actually completely lost. I think we went down when we should have gone up. So now let's go up. I mean, yeah, I mean, I'd rather be under the NCR than the, than the Legion. That's for sure. Sounds like we're running Prim now. I'd still mm. rather take my leave you? at the Strip. You're just an engineer. I think this Civilizing is... Civilizing Prim will show what we can do for everyone else in these territories. Is that her voice? No, it's the engineer. Where's your, where's your boss? I sense her in this direction. Oh. Where's it? Have you discovered what the Omertas are up to? Not really. Does it, is that okay? I've, it was something big. It involved snuff tapes and weapons. And I did stop them. And by stop them, I mean, made sure they were all very dead. Excellent. You'd think living in the lap of luxury and power would be enough for some people, but no. But we have other problems. While investigating the Amertas, what little I could on my end, I came across something much more sinister. Evidence suggests that Mr. House is planning to make some kind of move when the battle breaks out, and I'm guessing he won't be coming to our rescue. While we don't know what his exact plans are, my orders are to take no risks. I'm sending you to take Mr. House out of the equation. Any questions? Lady, I came here to get your help dealing with my Mr. House problem. And you're now turning around and saying, 
uh, could you please take care of our Mr. House? If I wanted to just kill him, I'd have gone and killed him, if, if that's possible. He does have a robot army. It's not a robot army of doom, I kind of made sure of that, but he still has a robot army. And to be honest, as much as I suspect he wants to kill me, I, I can't help but feel he does have a little bit of a reason for wanting to do that. So it's not like, you know, what could he be up to? What could he be up to? He was trying to get a robot army of doom, but that's done. It's over. He's, he's pretty much got a little robot army of sort of, you know, slightly meanness or something. It's not doom. It's no longer doom. What could he be up to? To name a few things off the top of my head, expand his borders, get the NCR and Legion to wipe each other out, and seize Hoover Dam. Any other questions? Yeah, no, that sounds like a pretty good plan, actually. I am better than my plan. My plan was to let you guys stay in a permanent state of stalemate and uh, make a lot of money and hope that you just stayed like that, which I guess was probably not going to happen. Something always gives, doesn't it? So he wanted to wipe you all out. That seems a little unpleasant as well. What evidence do you have that Mr. House will make a move while well, he was trying to get a robot army of doom? We've had reported sightings of Mr. House's Securitron spying on both NCR and Legion forces. Also, given a recent analysis of the sightings, we now estimate that Mr. House has at least four times as many Securitrons as previously assumed. He wouldn't Ooh. show his hand like that if he weren't prepared to move. And neither the NCR or Legion can spare the troops to investigate. Which is why I'm sending you. Any other questions? So you're saying he does, in fact, actually have a robot army of doom. Won't getting rid of Mr. House have huge repercussions for New Vegas? And, you know, and, uh, well, I was about to say me, but I suppose if I get rid of Mr. House, that is getting rid of my Mr. House problem. Perhaps, but that's not my problem. Whoa. Vegas is a nice place for the men to go on vacation, but it'd be an acceptable loss next to the dam. I thought Mr. House already agreed to hand over New Vegas to the NCR. Yeah, didn't he? Sort of, semi, kind of. Yes, that's what he wants us to believe. And when we turn our attention to other threats, he'll begin moving against us. Now, that is far true. safer to simply eliminate him and the risk he represents now. Besides, with him gone, New Vegas will truly be ours once the dust settles. Any other objections or questions? Questions? No. Good. Objections? Then you have See that Mr. House kind is of problem. Dismissed. I came to you so that you could help me. Why am I even bothering with these people? I... If you want something doing, do it yourself. Because if you try and get help, all you'll end up doing is doing it yourself with everyone else's blessing. Probably not even going to get paid, am I? Quietly. The Legion... I suppose it shouldn't come as any surprise to find out that everybody wants House dead. I mean, he's the man at the top and... Pe well, actually, Yes Man wants him killed or disabled, and the NCR want him removed as a threat. I suppose... No, she said take him out, didn't she? Arcade, what are you doing with my van? She did say take him out. I mean, honestly, let's face it. How would you disable a man like that? Let's face it. I've pretty much got no choice at this point. If I don't want to spend the rest of my life looking over my shoulder and waiting for one of these security... Securitrons. I have to see the word to be able to say it. Uh, it, it's just one of those words that needs a, a run-up for some reason. Securitron. Once I've said it a few times, I'm, I'm fine with it. I am... Um, probably shouldn't hang around in the middle of them. I keep expecting one of them to, to give me a message from Mr. House that involves, you know, bullets. But if I don't want to keep looking over my shoulder, I'm going to have... I don't know, maybe I could talk to him. Maybe I could say, look, seriously, I didn't want you to have a robot army of doom, which is why... Apparently he... He now has four times more robots than they thought, which means he does have a robot army of doom. I, I, just, I, I kind of feel like I need a plan. 
I feel like I need a plan here. Hello. You're always welcome in the staff. That is weird, actually. The, so, so the Securitrons don't actually... Can we talk to Yes... Oh, good grief. Let's talk to Yes Man, because it did say return to Yes Man. It's hard to sleep and place, where was Yes Man? Starting combat. I'm Just not even kidding. falling for it anymore. Wasn't he here? Was he not? I thought I saw him outside. Where is he now? Or is he downstairs now? Still. Maybe he didn't come out. Am I just dreaming that he came? Yeah, he's still in there, apparently. He's still in there. I could have sworn I spoke to him outside. Let's go talk to him. Let's go and talk to him. And first of all, see if we can remember where the hell he was. He was... Hi. It was the elevators up to Benny's room, right? If you can remember where the hell those were, he says, going the wrong way already. Oh, no, 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 I just wanted a detour. I'm throwing off anyone who's following me. Yes, that is what I'm doing. And... It was here. See? No problem. Yeah, okay, fine. Don't you just love that platinum chip? Buzzes with power and possibilities, doesn't it? If I were you, I'd almost want to deliver the chip to Mr. House, just to learn all its tricks. That is, unless you want to bring the NCR or Caesar's Legion to power, I wouldn't want to tell you what to do. Yeah, when was the last time you saw Ben? Have we not spoken since I... Oh, we've not, have we? This is... Right, I... Yeah. Right. Okay, when was the last time you saw Benny? It was a while ago. He came through here in a real hurry. Didn't even stop to say hello. I think he went down yeah. the secret escape elevator out in the hall. Did we not even have this conversation? Okay. Say Mr. House was going to suffer an accident. How would that happen? So, I should ask these tribes if they'll support an independent... An independent Vegas? You know... I'm saying that out loud, that, that there was a certain appeal to an independent Vegas. But that's going to put me in charge, isn't it? That puts me at the top. Big bullseye. On my head. What was Benny planning to do with the chip? Oh! He wanted to kill Mr. House and use the platinum chip to copy my neural computational matrix onto the Lucky 38's mainframe. That would give me control over all of Mr. House's defenses, most prominently his Securitrons. And then I guess I just do as I'm told. Okay. Can that actually be done? Sure. If the chip could be used to reset administrator privileges, it'll be super easy. Okay, so I should ask these tribes if they'll support an independent Vegas. We're talking about the main families, right? Oh no, I didn't mean that. Who needs their support? The Securitrons will be all the support you need. What I meant is, you should get to know these tribes and decide which ones you like and which you don't. You know, shape the future of Vegas. Choose your neighbors. If you like a tribe, leave it alone. Or, if a tribe is nasty, or going to be a problem, go ahead and exterminate it. It's whatever you want to do. See, this is why people shouldn't have robot armies of doom, okay? I mean, I want to wake up in the morning, have breakfast, and think, ooh, how can I have some fun today and make lots of money? Not wake up, have breakfast, and think, okay, which group of people should I mercilessly slaughter? Which tribe should I get to know? Is that what we're calling There's it now? There's a bunch. Some of them you've already met, like the chairman, for instance. I think you should visit the other families on this strip, the Omertas and the White Glove Society, so you know what makes them tick. And there are some important okay, like groups farther from the strip, too, like the Boomers, the Great Khans, and the Brotherhood of Steel. Well, I've met most of the... I've met most of these. Okay, say, Mr. Howard... We'll talk about that in a minute. The thing is, he's... So what you're saying is, I plug the chip into the mainframe, and you get control, right? You. 
But you will do as I say if I believe that, which I don't. And then we decide who to murder viciously. See, this is... No, I don't want... This is... This is... <sighs> Same as the house was going to suffer an accident. Let's just get to that part, because apparently, no matter what I do, that's probably going to have to happen, isn't it? Because otherwise, again, looking over my shoulder for the rest of my life. It makes me feel really dumb to admit this, but I don't actually know. I've never been inside the Lucky oh. 38. No one has. Mr. House is in I there, have. though. It's the central node of his entire network. I've been in the 38, and but Mr. House and I didn't get along. It sounds like Mr. House is just plain mean. No wonder the good guys want to kill him and take his stuff. If you've been inside the Lucky 38 before, the good I bet guys. you can get in again. And that's amazing. I mean, Benny was always scheming about how he was going to get into the Lucky 38, but you already took care of that. Wow. The other thing you're going to need is the Platinum Chip. You know, the one Benny killed a courier for yeah, over I've... your Good Springs. Yeah, yeah, I've actually... I've got that. What do you know about the courier Benny shot? I knew he was carrying the Platinum Chip, and I knew right where Benny should wait for him. That's why Benny put me here, to monitor Mr. House's data transmissions. They're all encrypted, of course, but I'm quite a decryptor. Did you know that Mr. House spent 812,545 caps hiring salvage teams to find the platinum chip? Just in the last year alone? How of much? Of course you didn't. Or that there were seven couriers, but six of them were carrying junk. How about their exact route and the mercenary teams that screened them? I knew all that. Pretty smart, huh? I'm sorry, I stopped listening at the 800,000 caps thing. Dude, if he'd offered me that, I might have... Get, I probably would have still blown the robot army of doom up, though. I mean, I want money. I do. I want... I, just, that's, I, I like the idea of being stinking rich. I just don't like the idea of being stinking rich and surrounded by somebody else's robot army of doom. Or my own robot army of doom, thank you very much. I'm the courier Benny shot. I know that's not true, because you still have a head. No, I'm serious. You set me up, now you do No, I'm serious. <laughs> that's not funny, you getting shot in the head. I okay, really dude. shouldn't have taken so much pride in how I set that up, huh? I feel really bad right now. You set me up, now you do oh, It's just a robot. I have the platinum chip, remember? I've got it. Of course you do. Sorry about that, and it's wonderful that you do. The Platinum Chip is the key to overriding and exploiting Mr. House's defenses. Did I just say exploiting? That's not a very nice word. Okay, you're freaking me out. The chip was supposed to activate an army of Securitons at the fort, but I blew you it up. Blew it up? That's just funny because that... Army seems like the secret weapon that was the whole point of, you know. I really admire how you stack the odds against yourself. Yeah, make things challenging. It's great, really, yeah. So, anyway. Seriously? You just did the smiley, sarcastic version of epic facepalm at me, didn't you? I hate that smiley face. I re I just... If something happens to miss the house, I may be in touch. I'll be waiting right here. Okay. I don't know about you, but I don't really like the idea of... Plugging him into a system that gives him access to a robot army of doom. It's strange, but the more people want me to kill Mr. House, the less inclined I feel to do so. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm fed up looking over my shoulder and expecting a robot army of doom to turn up on my doorstep so Mr. House says hello. But I also don't like the idea of being everyone else's tool. I mean, they're not even offering to pay me anything. I mean, 
this this whole thing started out with me trying to find people to help me deal with this problem, and now I'm just here dealing with this problem myself. But I feel like I'm doing it for everybody else. For free. And right now, I actually feel like I'd almost prefer Mr. House to stay exactly where he is. If only I could convince him not to, you know, kill me. We should probably prepare just in case that's not an option. Pulse slugs? Robots, right? I shouldn't go in with my weapon drawn. Maybe we can talk. I mean, yes, I did destroy part of his robot army of doom, but he still has one, apparently, and... I mean, here's the thing. I just don't like the idea of working for someone who has a robot army of doom, especially if I had a hand in helping him create that. But I guess I didn't. So maybe we can... I don't know. Just live and let live? Chat. You low-down snake. I wish I'd left you in the ground to rot. Draw. Sneaking okay, down. I'm guessing Breaking. that means not an option. Oh, pull slugs. Oh, how I love thee. I bet no one has ever been as unnoticed as me. Okay, I guess. Fighting over. We're not going to be chatting. I didn't really. You came here to finish what you think you started. Sort of, I suppose. Yeah. It's nothing personal. I just don't like robot armies of doom. This is nothing compared to what's waiting for you up in the penthouse. Okay, well, thank you for the warning. That's uh, very nice of you. Hello, Victor. Why won't it let me search Victor? Let me search. Oh. That was weird. That's nothing compared to what's waiting for me in the penthouse. Fair enough. You dared come here after what you did. Okay. You're making me a little less bothered about the idea of killing you. Uh, penthouse. I mean, I am... Ready. Steady. Okay. Ready. Felt a bit weird shooting her. Why does my shotgun keep disappearing? Okay, we got more, more Securitrons! God, these pulse slugs are awesome. Okay, that is bothering me now. That is bothering me. Do I have the same problem with... No. Okay. Where are the... Are they... Damn it, will you die already? No, I will not die already! Engaging. No, you're not. You've got pulse slugs in your face. You're not engaging. All right. More, more robots? I would have made you wealthy. You could have helped change the world. Right, but we would have been changing it with a robot army of doom. And I don't know if I've mentioned... I'm just... Not into that kind of thing. I mean, I get it. You are. And You're actually going to do this all over again? What all over again? What am I going to do all over again? Connection lost. What am I going to do all over again? Okay. Damn it, will you die already? No. Okay, we've got a terminal here. And the sounds of robots. Open antechamber. Warning, unauthorized user. Proceed. Um, Warning. yes? Room breach detected. Unauthorized oh. personnel in restricted area. Why are you doing this? Well, I, I would have chatted if you would. That looks... Destru Whoa! Was that all? Where are you? Oh. Drugs are breaking through my defenses. 
They're minimal at best. Chances of breaking through your defenses are minimal at best. I'm limping. I'm limping. Okay. I may have got through your defenses. Terminal. Warning unauthorized user proceed. Yes. Okay. Why are you doing this? Well, basically to save my own skin. Stay here. Go to the control room. You've come back to kill me this time, I assume. Well... Ironic how this turned out. The thousands of hours I spent calculating odds, running projections, planning for every contingency. Only to be done in by a mail carrier with a grandiosity complex. Oi! We'll have less of that. This mail carrier destroyed your robot army of doom, okay? Dude, is that you? Because it's over with, will you? Okay, unseal LS chamber. What's an LS chamber? Warning, microbial infection risk. Proceed. Okay, I guess. Oh, God. Are you going to get out and eat my brains? Oh. My. Okay, could you stop shaking? That is... I don't know which part of this is the most disturbing. Could you stop shaking? Because that's really... Why have you... Oh my Done God! This centuries of preparation, so much good undone. It's just I don't like you. The end. Yes, man, needs you. It's just I don't like you. That is true, but that's not. It's just business. It's not just business. The NCR asked me to get rid of you. Yes, man, needs you out of the way. I'm fed up of looking over my shoulder. Where's the... I'm fed up of you wanting me to... I mean, here's the thing. I came through the door with my weapons holstered. And your robot shot at me as I suspected they would. We could have talked this through. Don't like you. That is true. Fool to let personalities derail future. Of mankind. <gasps> Stupid. Wait, it's not your personality. It's not the, like, 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 well, it, partly that. I mean, you could have worked on that. It's more your kind of, you know, scheme, your plan, your nefarious, whatever we're going to call it. I mean, dude, you look, you're a shriveled corpse. You look like you should be sat in a little powered wheelchair screaming exterminate at the top of your lungs. I mean, really, it, you're not exactly easy to like. Time for you to die, Mr. House. You won't be able to control anything, but I'll let you live. I'll put you back in the tube good as new. Can we do that? Can I put you back in? Disconnected, obviously. Can't have you control anything, but, you know, just, you could lie there and... No! Ruined everything! Exposed! Germs. Yes, yeah, probably a the year of life. Forget I asked. If at most. And let oh grief. Let's face it. That I'm, why would you want to do? Why would you want to live like this anyway? I mean, should I? I? Have nothing to say. Okay. To you. Sterilize. LS chain. What does that do? Lethal shock risk if LS chamber is occupied. Oh. So that kills him. So we're, we're, we're basically, what we're saying now is I kill you 
or hmm. disable the cerebral interface? That just disconnects you. You no longer have power. Warning. LS chamber occupant will be unable to control subsystems. Subsystems. Proceed. Yes. Okay. So you won't be able... He's no longer a threat. If this statement is being broadcast, I am deceased. Please approach a secure drop and take one of the printed obituaries. Okay. Quest failed. The house has gone bust. Quest failed? What? How is that? Which quest was... The house has gone bust. You have irrevocably disconnected Mr. House from the Lucky 38 mainframe. That doesn't seem like a failed uh, situation to me. Okay, dude. Is he still alive? I can't, I... Yeah, he's moving. You know what? You're crippled. You yeah, I know I'm crippled. Welcome, Mr. Hat. I don't know. I'm getting a feeling this is not exactly... Hey. Yeah. Pretty sure that was the humane thing to do. Search Mr. House. Doesn't have anything on him. Not that I thought he would. Not really a huge number of pockets. On the bright side, we do seem to have... More whiskey. Does this mean this place belongs to me now? I mean... Oh, now you know what? Imagine what we could do with this if we could see out the window. I'm sure we must be able to see out the window somewhere. Oh. Oh, come on. Think of the possibilities. We could run this place. We could... We could make millions. I mean, I'm making a lot of money at, at, at the Prim Casino, but this one. Oh my God, I could become like the biggest casino owner in, well, probably Vegas, actually in the world. I can't imagine there's many places in the world that have more casinos than Vegas. You never know really, do you? I Robert Edwin House, am deceased. Please approach a Securitron and take one of the printed obituaries. Okay, are the Securitrons going to be... friendly? Hi. Be advised, the Lucky 38 is not open to the general public. Oh, I got a Trust note! Trespassers will be shot. Thank you. Yeah, not anymore they won't. Actually, that's a good point. The place is pretty insecure at the moment. Because, like, no one's controlling you, which means you're an autopilot. I mean, maybe I should put Yes Men in there? I don't like the idea of him being in charge of a robot army of doom. No, I don't. A tragedy has befallen all mankind. Oh, my God. Robert Edwin House, 261, is that 261 years of age, president, CEO, and sole proprietor of the New Vegas Strip, industrialist and technologist, founder, president, and CEO of a multi-billion dollar pre-war robotics and software corporation, Robco Industries has died. That was one sentence, dude. I'd say punctuation, use it, but you used plenty of it, but oh my god. Generally recognized by Mr. House to be mankind's only hope. Wait a minute, generally recognized by Mr. House. How can you generally recognize something by yourself? To be mankind's only hope of long-term survival, Mr. House's passing may well sound a death knell for the entire human race. Lost forever is the bounty of knowledge concerning human longevity. That was not longevity, and it certainly wasn't human. The depth and breadth of which could, as he was apt to say, fill several textbooks. He was not exaggerating. No. Would Mr. House exaggerate? 
Though he did not achieve his goal of functional immortality, let us not forget that he died at the age of 261. A shriveled kind of walnut looking thing that had more in common with a sci-fi bad guy than an actual human being. How many people do that? Not many, got to admit. I mean, come on. Also, lost forever are House's singular personality, force of will, vision, and leadership ability. The probability of equally capable figure emerging from the current human population to lead mankind to a future of equivalent quality is less than 0.000112% by objective measures too complex to detail in this obituary. Well, let's hope that's right. Personality and force of wi Oh my god, how long does this go on for? Personality and force of will, born June 25th, 2020. House was orphaned at an early age when his parents died in a freak accident. Autogyro lightning. Though cheated of his inheritance, House attended the prestigious institute in Massachusetts and founded Robco Industries on his 22nd birthday. Within five years, it was one of the most profitable corporations on earth. Vision. By 2065, House was certain that an atomic war would soon devastate the planet. And instead of doing anything about it, what, go on, what did you do? At great personal expense, he developed technologies to ensure the structural integrity of the city of Las Vegas, as it was known at the time. On the day of the Great War, 77 atomic warheads targeted the city Mr. House defeated them all. Talk about vision. Well, then you must have known that there was a vault underneath, I guess. I suppose you were hoping to use them to repopulate the planet or something? Why didn't you go down there with them? I suppose you had to stay up here in control. Leadership. Mr. House survived the war, of course, and would later recruit the three families, negotiate the Treaty of the New Vegas, and rebuild the Vegas Strip. While these achievements yielded many immediate benefits, they were all part of House's master plan to reignite mankind's quest for technological advancement, a plan without which the human race had nowhere to go and nowhere to turn. We'll revise and finish this up later. Have set the age of death to update automatically. Obit makes silent salient points, but pearls before swine, of course. Let's hope the ingrates never have cause to read it. Who knows how many of them are even literate. Kind of glad he's dead now. Yippee, yeah, there'll be no wedding bells for today. Cause I got spurs that jingle, jangle, jingle. Jingle, jangle. As I go riding merrily. 